Firstly, I would like to change the fact that Keith would be alive. It would be nice. <laughs> Do we have to like come back? Back, 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 back? Oh! <laughs> we have other memories here. I wonder what's the difference uh, between the blue and red ones though. Do I have to find every single memory in the game? <laughs> ah, let's see like overall. The first day is done. Second as well. It will essentially come down to my progress in the whole game. Because I think I've been doing pretty well. On the 4th, we start having issues. This is a chess piece. And a lab coat. Uh, okay, it's gonna be a lot of cutting of the footage. This is one. I was just randomly checking things that I didn't do like other locations. It's almost time to begin the experiment. Double check the drone control system. Understood. Hmm. Standard dosage exceeded. Current dosage liable to have serious adverse effects on the subjects. That's of no concern. The experiment will go ahead. I'm sorry. Hal. Maya. Please forgive me. Maybe the red memories will be like minor ones that... I don't know if they will change much. For the rest, like... I have no idea. I think I'll start with the obvious stuff like saving Keith. And then we'll go from there. I'm still wondering if that will change anything cause... He might be dead regardless. Okay. I didn't realize this place had visiting hours. What were you up to just now? None of your business, short stuff. I think you'll find the word you're looking for is compact, mister. You know what else begins with C? Childish. Keith. You've been communicating with the outside cities this whole time, haven't you? What are you talking about? We need you to come with us. You're no good to us dead. This place is about to get raided. You're a sitting duck here. <clears throat> Help! Keith! We need to get going! Hide in the interrogation room until the coast is clear. You... Fine. Have it your way. So... How did you figure out I was in contact with the outside cities? I read the message you were about to send. They're worried about the tower. That's why they've been keeping an eye on us. Astrum Close is in real danger. That's why you came here to mediate between the professor and the city representatives, right? Something like that. I was trying to bring Albert back into the fold. Three years ago, he cut off all ties with the outside world. Back then, I figured something had happened to the old guy. Now, though, I think he suspected the Bureau was monitoring his dealings with the other cities. By the way, what's the Bureau planning to do about the tower? What's happening to the clock tower doesn't have anything to do with the Bureau. The key that vanished 12 years ago found its way back to the city. That's what caused all this. It's just a coincidence. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, well. I'm going to make things right, Keith. I need you to call off the bombardment, though. I'll get you out of here. Don't worry. Hmm. Oh, please. I could stroll right through the gate anytime I felt like it. On my own, that is. If that's the case, you need to get on the road as soon as you can. I had more than one reason for coming here, you know. I came here to check on you, champ. Oh yeah? What's helping you, mister? Well, when you put it that way, just a one-time travel companion. Still, I'm the one who brought you here. I'm responsible for what happens to you. It was my choice to stay here. Ah, so you finally remembered. Thanks to you, Keith. I met some people I truly care about. Keith, I need you to do this for me. Get them to call off the bombardment. Leave it to me. Okay. That's it? I'll get going once the heat is off. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. You hear me? Nothing behind your back? What now? I... There's not much else to do. Let's get going. We need to stop Cestelia before it's too late. Okay. So, should I go back now to the memories or...? By the definition of here, nothing changed. That's what I'm saying, like, about the time travel stuff. It's not gonna be consistent, so... I don't know if anything I'll do will make a difference. This is for sure a diary we found, but it didn't register. Now to think of it. I never entered Gnome's room. Can I? So that's where this plushie was. This. And chess piece, okay. Well, that was kind of useless because we had this same story in the first episode, I feel like. <sighs> oh. <laughs> Sleep? I'm not sleepy at all. Hal, tell me a story. Okay. Here. Do you know what this picture is? Uh, it's a humanoid guardian that's lying in the desert way out east. <laughs> this is just odious references all over. Even further east than where I used to live. What's a humanoid guardian? Well, back in the past. These kind of godlike beings came down from space. They were huge, big enough to block out the sky. I don't know why, but apparently they were really angry at all the humans. They roared with all their might and devastated the whole land. Anyway, the Guardian had a person controlling it. They faced the angry gods and protected all the humans. That's what I heard. Did that really happen? Yeah. It's not like I saw it myself, though. Mr. Keith told me about it when we were on our way here to the city. Why do you always bring him up? What? I used to love his stories. They helped me forget all my bad dreams. I... 
No. Looks like he's nodded off. <laughs> We're literally getting everything here. <laughs> oh. I was searching for this, not this. So I'll just cut off the thing. <laughs> Biped? Hell, I made some tea. Mmm, mm, this is good. Hey, where's this tea from, by the way? Apparently it's from way down south. Not that I've been. In the middle of this tiny village, at the foot of a mountain, there's a giant tree. When you strip the tree's bark, it gives off a sweet scent, just like the tea. Apparently, the whole village smells like it. Nobody lives there anymore. But the tree is still there. They say the village is counting down the days. Until the particle contamination clears up, and people can return home. Yeah, that's what I heard anyway. Hey, do you still want to go outside? Yeah, of course. But I'm not going to go by myself. Ever since nightfall... The professor's been trying to figure out how we can recover. He's doing all that research for us, too, you know? If it works out, people will stop being so harsh to variants. We won't have to live in the shelter anymore. Once it's safe, I'll take you both outside the dome. You hear me? When we leave, we leave together. All right, then. Just don't go running off and breaking your promise, okay? <laughs> Maya's back! Cool. What's this? Right, I was confused. <laughs> What are you doing? Professor! Oh, it's you, no. Professor, Maya won't wake up! Hmm... Hal says he can't remember me. He's so confused all the time. Is that so? Professor, you've got to help them. Put them back to how they used to be. You can do that, can't you? Please? Hal has been freed from his past, even for a moment. As far as I'm concerned, it's for his own good. No more chasing the shadows of people he's lost. Besides... Professor! Get out, Noel. I don't want to see you here again. Abu? Professor, why? Why did you betray us? You were supposed to be protecting us! Okay, I think that should be down. Let me check. First episode done. Second one, it seems like as well. I'm just missing this, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter. Or like, it's a bonus or something. The key memories are more important. So the only things left is this. I found it. I don't know why it didn't register. So let's go back to the clock tower. I just need to figure out which floor was it. It's here. I mean... I really took it, but... Or should gave you back? You're still up? So, look at once say we should decide. Yeah, is you I was what it, it's Oh wait 
Whoa. <laughs> A memory dive inside the memory dive. Nice game. How? What's the matter? Did you have a bad dream? <laughs> I would never expect that. Okay, well. Secret solved. We can fully go to the final ending. I think. Come here. Your mom will make everything better. What on earth am I doing here? I should be right there with him, keeping the nightmares at bay. Sonia! I'm gonna hold on to this. Okay, let's go to... Memory... Palace. <laughs> I did everything, Mom! What now? You're almost there. Oh, don't tell me I need to actually find this chest. Come on! <laughs> I'm so close. This is the gun chest. Because I can see the pattern. To get there, I would need to be off my duty. Or just go to the hotel room whenever it's possible. Now the question is, was it in her room or Keith's room? I mean, I don't remember which one is which one though. Okay, well... <laughs> yeah, because this was the murder scene. This. It looks just like the cape. I think it's where'd the gun go? But I thought I got it. Hmm. This looks about right. I think. I've got to show Hal one of these days. I'll bet he'll freak out. That's all. 